Yeah, my name is Star, and I went on the Dragons trip with the Andes and Amazon program in 2017 in the spring semester. Yeah, so um, for the gap year, I didn't take a gap year immediately from high school. So I took a gap year after my first semester at my uh, Carton College. And I wanted to take a gap year because I feel I always wanted to travel. And I feel like I'm always living in a bubble like without knowing too much about the outside world. And I think college is a really great experience to make me find what I want to do. Um, but before that, I really want to like learning more about myself and the world. So I think that will prepare me to like find a path in college. Um, so that's why I decided to like take a gap year before like, going fully into the college experience. And I choose the Amazon. Oh, sorry. I choose the Amazon and, and this program because I'm always fascinating about the uh, South America, and I never been to South America before. But I, like read a lot of like books about the Andes and the Amazon. I was so fascinated. I really want to just like go there and see like what's out there. Um, yeah, so I think I wanted to take a gap year during the summer uh, of my after high school. Um, but because I'm an international student from China, so there's not so many people doing a gap year in China. So I'm not exactly sure like the plan. So I think I can first go to college and see like what I want to do. And in the college, I get to meet other people and I meet other people with the Dragons program. So I have a more concrete plan about like what to do. So I just decided to like take turns off and begin my gap year. Yeah, I think I meet a lot of people that influences me and I suddenly forgot his name. It's so bad, but his name, he's the, he's the like leader in the, the take out to the Apua Sangate. He's like the community leader and he has a wife and he leads us, he is based in, near Cusco, I think. And, and I feel really, because I feel really connected with him because he is from those indigenous community and he has so much like belief from those community that's like so interesting to me. Um, for example, like he lead us to do a lot of ceremony with the coca leaf and one time he told us that and nowadays people who live in the city, they're so far away from the nature. Um, there's a lot of pollution and people's the spirit there is not very like flourishing because of the they're very far away from the nature. And I think it was I so interesting to me how we respect nature and how we get to connect with nature again. And that's like what I learned from him. Yeah, I feel like dragons really um, helped me to become a global citizenship um, because even after dragon, I uh, study about twice, like once in Budapest, another time in Spain. And I also went back to Peru um, just last winter. I went back to the Amazon and I stayed there for three months as a volunteer. Um, so I think it helped me continually to like they're curious about the world outside of my world, uh, my country, and continue to like um, travel and then hear about and learn about the issues in all the other places. So, like, not only care about myself, but continue to be a global citizenship and care about issues in different countries. I think the study abroad program is very different than. Uh, gap year program with dragons um, because the program in Budapest is a computer science program is my major and I did a lot of academic like just taking classes and then just on traveling to other uh, cities um, but I think what's really special about dragon is that it allows you to go to a lot of like communities and really like immerse in their life and connect with people which is kind of like hard if you just do travel by yourself. Um, so I really value those relationship and community I get to visit during my Dragon's program. 
first I get to hike up on Sangate, which is so cool. I really like the hiking. Um, I get to go to the Amazon for the first time. That's really cool. And I really like Papa de la Papa. It's an indigenous community near Cusco, and they have a lot of llama and um, alpaca. I'm very happy to be there. Be my water bottle because I always need water. I don't know if the best food is a very interesting food is um, the guinea pig in Peru. It was so interesting and yeah, it was like very interesting experience. Yeah, so right now I'm a student. Um, I'm a junior, a computer science major. And I'm planning to do like summer internship with Salesforce this summer. Um, so I'm probably gonna go into like computer science, uh, machine learning, and this like tech industry. Yeah, and I think it's really interesting to have Dragon Connection because I want to volunteer with um, a program in the Las Pietras Research Center in Amazon near Puerto Maldonado, and they told me that the Dragons program go there as well. So it was really cool to see Dragons persons in a lot of places.